and they're the only school I found with uh, web and digital media development. It's the only program that really had something web-based. Um, so that's what originally drew me here. I actually ended up changing that to a minor, but that's how yeah, I got Yeah, I started in WDMD, um, and just like everyone who comes here, Professor Dallinger tries to convince everyone to take a double major. So I initially did that um, and just ended up dropping WDMD to a minor because I kind of grew interest more towards CIS. Most of the classes I've taken, especially in WDMD, have been really small, which is really nice because um, you get a lot more one-on-one -on -one time with the professor. Um, so that you can answer questions and get answers quickly in class and that sort of thing. Um, a lot of the courses also had work time in the labs, which was really nice to collaborate with other students, um, which was really helpful when you're trying to figure out issues or even just helping other students. Um, a great way to learn is to teach someone else. So having the opportunity to help someone else out with problems and have them help you out with your issues is really helpful and I think prepares you a lot for the workforce when you're doing that exact same thing. One of my favorite classes was in the Computer Information Systems track, uh, CIS 310. I thought it was a lot of fun because it was the first class, for me anyway, that had a project that lasted for probably about half the semester. Uh, we started kind of introducing in the beginning of the semester and then ended up starting about halfway through and finishing it by the end for your final. Um, it is really good to go through the entire experience because up until then you had seen parts of development and part of the cycle, but being able to actually go through it from start to finish was really nice. Um, and Gibbs is, just does a really good job of keeping the class light. Um, I applied at Skyward the summer after my sophomore year um, and got accepted to start there um, as a part-time. I've been working there for about a year and a half now. Um, I work on the framework team of their current progress software. Um, so it's been a really good experience for me. Um, I work a lot in JavaScript and on the web side of things, which is what I really enjoy and what I have most experience in. Um, and it's really helped me learn a lot of things that I wasn't or wouldn't have learned in the program. It's been very, very valuable. Um, I think it'll help me a lot when I'm either continuing there or looking for careers elsewhere. Um, initially, probably staying at Skyward for a little while. Um, probably gonna be moving somewhere to girlfriend and go to grad school. So wherever we end up moving to, um, either we're working remotely from Skyward for a little while, otherwise um, exploring the, the job market wherever we move to. Um, there's a lot of jobs for CIS students, so I don't think this would be much of a problem with how prepared I am from this program. My dad first um, allowed me to help him with a computer program when I was like eight or so. Um, and since then, I've just kind of been engrossed by computers, not just programming, but everything. I worked at Geek Squad for a while repairing them. I, before that, I sold computers. Um, so I, it's a field that I would work even if it wasn't good money. It's just kind of an added perk that the job I love to do pays really well and is really easy to get into. One of the big things that I liked about here, um, other than having the WDMD, pro WDMD program at the beginning, was how small and tight-knit the community is. Um, it's a really small campus. It's, you can get from one side to the other in 10 minutes, so you're really not, especially with how cold it gets here, you're not walking all that far, which is nice. Um, but when you do want to go outside, there's tons of outdoor activities to do from, you know, kayaking, canoeing on the rivers and going for bike rides and that sort of thing. Um, tons and tons of great restaurants. Downtown's always a bunch of fun. Uh, it's just a really good community to be in when you're not stuck in school. I'd really recommend um, enjoying some of the outdoors. You know, if you don't have a bike, get a bike so you can go for bike rides. It's really good to relax yourself and there's a lot of, a lot of nature to enjoy here. Um, especially in Schmeekly, right, you know, stick throw away. Um, enjoy the outdoors and try every restaurant at least once. There's lots of good places that people don't necessarily know about.